All right, what's up, niggers? I'm still drunk. <laughs> it's my night off. So, constant stream of fucking drunk here. Who's next? Jock Derrida? Is that, that's the guy. In, in when, <coughs> fuck. <coughs> it's a weed cough, man. It's a fucking, it's a COVID cough. Get over it. I still pee, you know, I still pee, 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 pee. <laughs> That's how you know I'm drunk. I still see people wearing masks around all day long. Uh, I'm I'm just confused by it. I don't, I don't understand what's going on. <laughs> what's going on anymore in this universe? Because I, I've never worn a mask. Every time I was forced to wear a mask, I said, no, thank you. And I did not go into the store. But, so, <clears throat> Jock Derrida. I'm seeing a pattern here, and the pattern is philosophy of language. Um, do I even have a fucking book on that? I think I might even have a book on philosophy of language. I don't know where it is. It's, it's probably over here somewhere. I don't. Is it fucking god damn it? There's no lights on in this motherfucker. It's got to be up here somewhere. Uh, I don't know where it might be. But the idea behind this man's philosophy is that there are no ideas behind this man's philosophy. It's empty. He says nothing. Seriously. Go and look him up. I got him confused with like 18 different philosophers because I never understood where his... Meta he <laughs> At least Kant had a critique of metaphysics. This motherfucker has no critique of anything, I, as far as I can tell. You know, oh, wait, 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 wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Lived experience. Language is a tool. We all understand this. We're getting to Wittgenstein. He's next. <laughs> right? Wittgenstein is the next guy on the chopping block of these motherfuckers that you put on the chopping block. Except, <laughs> why? Dude, seriously. I don't understand it. I don't understand why you would think this guy has something to say about anything at all when he doesn't even think he has anything to say about anything at all. That's his fucking, like, dude. He's like a suicidal fucking, like, kid, man. Dude. Makes no sense to me. If you want to have a philosophy, have it be pragmatic. Have it be, you know, make some fucking sense, nigger. That's the way I look at it. All right? So we're done with that motherfucker. I, I don't even want to... What is there to talk about? Because, you know, if, if I start talking, if I write something down, it's just going to be deconstructed. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here, man. What I really want to talk about is this. Dude, I'm going to put this. He's got 24 hours to respond. That's it. Then it's going up on the wall. You can already see it. I mean, I just didn't put it up on the wall. This motherfucker that want to critique me about my my criticism of transfinite analysis. Coincidentally enough, just perfectly timed, after I had a private conversation with Diane Vera, who was making the exact same fucking arguments that he made in the public post, which is it's there, you can go look at it. I just haven't posted it on my wall, but if you find the video... The one where I d destroy transfinite analysis. It's called Cantor's Diagonal Argument Destroyed. Something like that. You can go look. You'll see it. And you'll see exactly the questions that I gave. Questions that he will not be able to answer. Because his mathematical Platonism is fictitious. It's made up. And... It's it's like arguing uh, who's stronger, Superman or the Hulk, dude. <laughs> That's what it is. That's what it is. Yeah, I'm done with Derrida. Fuck him. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but there's a key point running through this. If you can if you can fucking figure it out, there's a key point running through this video. You can deconstruct Superman, you can deconstruct the Hulk, but who's stronger? 
You know what the answer is? Hold on. It, 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 do the Jeopardy thing. Ding, 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 ding. Who's stronger? You have the idea? Whoever the writer says is stronger, nigger. That's that's who's stronger. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta be a dum dum not to understand that. So which number is bigger? <laughs> And an effable cardinal or a Ramsey cardinal? Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Come on, man. You're not going to beat me, motherfucker. I don't care how hard you try. And I really appreciate the fact that Diane Vera tried to send her own assassin after me. After I was an assassin for her and I got the kill. You feel me, nigga? I took the bag out. You ain't gonna take this bag out. This ain't no bag. This a nigga. I'm I'm fucking rolling, nigga. You feel me? You gotta be a weirdo <laughs> to think you're gonna take this motherfucker out. You, you, the, the, nope. It's not happening, bro. <laughs> it's not happening. Um, get your bag up early <laughs> and put it on your shoulder, nigga. <laughs> oh shit, it weighs a bit, <laughs> doesn't it? You feel me? Cause you ain't gonna be able to answer my questions. You're going to try. I, I can see you. I can see you in my mind's eye sitting there. You're fucking trying to figure it out. How do I answer these questions? Because I can't. <sighs> Go take that bag back to Diane. Say you couldn't do it. With apologies. <laughs> I quit. I used to moderate for her. And I quit. She was way too demanding. She was way way too bossy. She was way too... Well, I'm not going to get into that because that would be, you know, too much information. But, nah. You ain't going <laughs> to... This dude here, this nigga right here, he ain't going down, man. Oh, you can try. Matter of fact, I think I will put it up on the wall. I'll put it up on the wall tomorrow morning, man. Fuck this shit. I mean, it's already there. It's not like it's hidden. And no, I'm not going to fucking share private information. I'm not going to fucking put Diane's conversation up. No, fuck that. That that would be goofy. But the conversation between you and me, whoever the fuck you are, muffins for toast or toast for muffins or whatever the fuck your name is. <laughs> just a goofy name just to be on the internet. <laughs> like an old resuscitated sock account that's what it is come on now let's be real about it that's what it fucking is you want to take down the king you're gonna have to try harder than that shit nigger you feel me try to tell me <laughs> the exact same arguments that she gave me in a private conversation you're making a public conversation on a video that nobody watches really Put your face on the internet. I'll do the same. I, I mean, my face is out there. Everybody knows who I am. But, dude, seriously? <laughs> That's got to be the gayest fucking shit. Nothing wrong with gay people. I, I love I love me some gays, man. It's Pride Month, man. Come on now. Gay people are awesome. It's just the transes and the weirdos I have problems with. <laughs> you didn't see the fucking... Did you see the fucking latest video from Britt Cooper? Brett Cooper? Oh, yeah. I mean, it turns out they are trying to turn your frogs gay. Don't watch that. Don't watch anything that I fucking tell you to watch. Because you're going to get confused. You're going to be fucking non-binary at the end of the day, man. But if you want to have an argument... Dude, I'll do it live. I'll go live with you, man. But you won't do that. Because you're private. But who, hey, we're going to finish this out at 10 minutes. You know who I will go live with? <laughs> Mr. Thomas Leroy. Moderated by one Mr. Dark Fool. We're going to have a fun time. This is, this is the future, man. Not none of this other garbage shit. So, fuck all y'all weirdos, man. And unsubscribe if you're a weirdo. Please do that. Otherwise, stay tuned. <laughs>